Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel, this is JP Gaming UK. If you're new here, welcome to my channel and I hope you enjoy my content. Well, it's finally here. The new Sims for My Wedding Stories pack is out. Um, I've got a lot to say on it. <laughs> uh, it's, well, let's put it this way, it's been a rocky a few weeks getting here. Um, well, this is my first build using the new pack. Um, it's called Riverside Chapel. I'll get into more detail about it soon. I just wanted to talk about um, the pack a little bit and some of the issues that I've been experiencing with it and to see if anyone else has kind of been experiencing the same problems. I've been looking on Twitter and whatnot and um, a, 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 a couple of the problems I've been running into, some people have been having. But this is just a few things that um, I've been running into. I'm normally a builder, so it's it's quite rare for me to actually kind of like do some gameplay but i really wanted to give it a go because i really do enjoy like holding like lavish parties and weddings and stuff so i wanted to see um how this new pack held up against that well let's just put it this way it starts off well and then it goes downhill pretty quick um my guess um the planning of the wedding I had no problems with that at all. I um, selected like who I wanted to be my sim of honor, uh, chose the cake, chose the attire, um, stuff like that. It all that all was all fine. I had no problems with that at all. Is the uh, and even the batch party that all went fine. I had no, I, I ran into no issues with that. At, uh, well, I ran into issues when it comes to the toasting. Like not everyone was gathering, but apart from that, the um, the batch party that went all fine. But the wedding is the is the bit that had the main problem. The wedding started off absolutely fine. Everybody turned up, then literally it all just literally went downhill. None of my guests arrived in the. Um, I chose polished attire and a, and I chose the a, a, like a pink color. Um, no one arrived in anything like that. Some people arrived in swimwear. Some people arrived in just their everyday clothes. Some people were like hadn't even had a bath um uh when i was requesting like uh my my designated sims to go down the aisle like my um my ring bearer my sim of honor they weren't going down the aisle um when i was requesting when i requested them to, to, to take their seats everyone took their seats including the people that were supposed to be important parts of the wedding and then they wouldn't get back up after that um, the person that was officiating my wedding, she sat down and wouldn't get up. So um, I literally had, just had to s send both my sims down the aisle on their own and hold the ceremony themselves at the altar. The ceremony pff, worked in parts. Um, one of the sims exchanged their vows, the other one didn't. Um, they never exchanged rings. Um, I'm just trying to th remember what else happened. Um, they kissed at the altar, uh, that went fine, um, but then after all of that, they had the wedding. They, uh, I chose the guests to throw rice. They did I, when I selected it. It wasn't showing up on the list of things for Sims to do, so um, I thought, okay, that's not working. They decided, okay, we'll do it now. At the end, when it was all finished, they were just throwing rice everywhere. My Sim went to the toilet. They followed her and threw rice at her while she was having a wee. As she was sat in the cubicle having a wee, they were throwing rice at her over the door, um, which I found quite funny, but still quite annoying. Um, what else? Uh, sorry, I've got it all written down in front of me. Um, oh yeah, my my female sim, the bride, kept getting changed out of her wedding dress into swimwear. Um, I kept having to change her back. Um, yeah, I kept, uh, I kept having to change her back. Oh, my wedding cake never turned up. I brought a wedding cake, um, selected it for my wedding. So it, it, the message popped up, this cake has been selected for your wedding. It'll be kept safe and you can have it on your wedding day. It never turned up. It wasn't in my Sims inventory. Um, uh, guests kept ignoring my requests and stuff. Uh, so to be honest, the gameplay has been incredibly disappointing. Um, I hope it does get fixed soon um, because literally the gameplay is the whole point of this pack. Um, yes, the, uh, I'll get onto the building in a second, but the whole point of this wedding pack was the gameplay. And it doesn't work, it's broken. Um, and they held it for another week. I've, I was expecting them to fix it. They've done nothing. This is exactly the same as the preview version that the um, game changers, sorry, the um, they've changed it, haven't they? 
the EA uh, Creator Network were doing. Um, there's been, okay, yes, there's been the odd tweak here and there which works, but it's still as broken as it was when the um, creators were d using the preview builds. So, yeah, it's once again they've dropped a DLC which is broken, buggy, and they're doing this a lot lately. Um, I'm thinking this may be the last pack I buy because I'm sick of sinking my money into half assed broken stuff now and I, and th things are getting so expensive that I've just got to start watching my money and start you th think you're thinking a bit more sensible with it but anyway let's get on to my build this is Riverview Chapel and Reception Garden it's a quaint little chapel with um, a lovely little landscape garden for the reception after the service it's got a glass canopy dance area where your sims can like like where my wedding was happening, it was raining a lot, so it was quite handy to have the dance floor undercover. Um, it's also got a nice little eating area that's under those wooden kind of like little shelter things. Uh, it's also got a sunken bar and it's also got a photo area just outside the church so your sims can have their photos taken on the big day. But anyway, this is the build. There will be some screenshots at the end so you can see um, what the build looks like, all finished, all the landscaping done, and from the Sims perspective. I've also got a few pictures at the end of the screenshots of my Sims lot at their wedding. Um, Adele and uh, Jake, it was their wedding day. So uh, yeah, there's some pictures of, of, of those at the end. I really do hope you enjoyed this build. This um, The gallery is on the, uh, sorry, the chapel is on the gallery now. You can, can download it right away. It's called Riverview Chapel. Uh, but I will leave a link to it in the description below or you can just search for my um, gallery ID which is JP Gaming UK with the number one on the end. Um, I've also got another build on there that I did yesterday as well. It's a starter home for um, Tartosa. It's just under 19,000 simoleons. Um, it's a one bedroom little quaint like um, rustic Spanish cottage. So that's available to go and download too. Uh, it's called verbatim villa uh, i'll also leave a link to that in my description as well so you can go and download that too well anyway guys i hope you've enjoyed this uh this speed build and uh, in, enjoyed my little rant about the game but i feel like i'm not alone when it comes to this pack with how annoyed i am um but anyway enjoy this build guys if you're new to my channel please drop me a like and subscribe it really does help my channel to grow i'll also leave a link in the description below to all of my socials because i'm now on instagram facebook twitter and tumblr so feel free to go follow me all on there and i'll see all of you guys in my next video and happy weddings if it works